Welcome to our version of Little Bo Peep. Let's hear it for Sophie Bo Peep and Eddie Bo Storyteller. Sophie Bo Peep has lost her dinosaurs. Ahem, Eddie, it's sheep. Right, sheep. Sophie Bo Peep has lost her sheep. I'm so worried I can't even sleep. Where are you, sheep? I'm so sad I might... <gasps> weep. Poor sleepy and weepy Sophie Bo Peep. <laughs> Greetings, Earthlings. We come in peace. But our ship comes in pieces. Uh, Tessa, Mia, we're trying to... We are not Tessa and Mia. We are a two-headed alien from a distant planet, and we would like to be, be in, in your play. play. Sorry, but there isn't a two-headed alien in Sophie Bo Peep. But we have sneaker hands. There aren't any of those in the story either. What about polka dot feet? Mm, nope. I knew we wouldn't fit in. We are different from Earthlings. We'll just fix our spaceship and go home. Sorry about that. Okay, who wants to see the rest of our play now? <laughs> Oops, wrong sound effect. No, that gives me a great idea. Why don't we go somewhere we can do our play with real sheep? Yes, we'll go to the farm. Hey, want to come to the farm with us? We cannot leave our ship. You must go without us. Okay, see you later. Hit it, Ziggy! Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. We sing this It takes to be in the play. Ba 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 ba. Wonderful! You can be sheep number one. Ba 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 ba. Wow! I think we have our sheep number two. Ba. Not quite what we're looking for. Sorry. Um. Simon. Simon, yes. Really good try, though. Hey, guys! King Pigalot is coming to see the show. Really? When? Uh, right now. I have arrived. Now, entertain me! <laughs> You're on! Welcome, farm animals, and, uh, your royal pigginess. Well, thank you. <laughs> when the story begins, Sophie Bo Peep has lost her sheep. I'm so worried, I can't even sleep. Where are you, sheep? I'm so sad I might... <laughs> so sad I might... <laughs> I might... Might dance, juggle, stand on your head? I love the suspense. I might have to go find my sheep. That's not your line. I think Simon is running away because I might have hurt his feelings. How? I mean, uh, how about we take a short intermission? I told Simon he couldn't be in the show because he doesn't sing very well. I've got to apologize to him. 
Keep the show going while I'm gone. But I can't. Sophie Bell Peep has lost her sheep, and she will find him. Oh, I didn't expect that. Very good, very good. What happens next? Next, right, yes. Uh, I know. How about some jokes? Why does a rooster watch TV? Anyone? For entertainment. Haha, <laughs> entertainment. Get it? <laughs> oh, was that supposed to be funny? Oh boy, I'm in trouble. Simon! Oh, Simon! Where is my sheep? Answer me, Simon. It's Sophie Bo Peep. <laughs> Simon, I'm sorry I hurt your feelings. So sorry I am. Please, can you talk to me? Dear little lamb. All the other sheep sing great. I just wanted to sing with them. But all I can do is... I get it. I know. It's hard when you can't be part of the show. You should go back. The king's waiting. You've got the lead role. Eddie's got everything under control. Thanks for trying, Sophie. But I can't sing like the other sheep. My ba ba's different. Simon, wait! Don't run away. Listen, there's something I want to say. North or south or east or west, we sing this little tune. Earth is different from the sun and different from the moon. I wear a pair of glasses, my glasses help me see. And if I didn't wear them, I'd walk into a tree. I say, and it's cool that we are different, cause different, different is okay. North or south or east or west, we sing this little tune. Earth is different from the sun and different from the moon. We're all a little different. And that is why we say, it's cool that we are different, cause different. Simon, I've got the rule for you. Come back. I'll show you what to do. So, Sophie Bo Peep has lost her sheep. They're lost in the fog. So thick and so deep. Where are you? Where are you? Can anyone hear? Ba. That sounds like Simon. Simon, my dear. Simon, oh Simon, keep making your wonderful sound. The others will hear and soon be homeward bound. Ba. Bravo! I pronounce this the greatest Bo Peep story ever! Tessa! Mia! I mean, two-headed alien! Are you leaving? Yes, we are going back to our planet where we are not different. But there's always room for difference. So, will you please be in our play? Okay, nice Earth person. What is the play about? Hmm. Well, 
What if a two-headed alien lands on Earth? And an Earth guy borrows their spaceship for a spin around the galaxy. Whoops. And then Sophie Bo Peep goes to play with the two-headed alien while the Earth guy fixes their spaceship. This is an excellent story. <laughs> <laughs> for first place in a spelling contest. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, this is one of my favorites. I got this trophy for being the strongest kid in my class. No, wait. Oh, right, sorry. This one was a trophy for doing the best handstand. I always get those two awards mixed up. I wish I had a trophy. Oh, don't worry, Mia. Maybe when you get a little bigger, you'll win an award for... for... for something. Thank you. Thank you all for this award. Uh, Mia? My trophy? Oh, right. Oh, rats. I wish I could win something. Well, you're just in time for the county fair, down on the farm. Eddie, Kobe, are you ready? It's time for another adventure. I'll go get the wagon. Hit it, Ziggy. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. We sing this song. 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 Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And we're extra so excited. So here we go. A real county fair has so much cool stuff to see and do. And there's lots of ways to win ribbons and trophies. I'm going to teach these chickens to sing and enter the singing chicken contest. Here, chicky, chicky, chicky. I'm going to make the best pie ever and win the pie making award. What about you, Kobe? Hmm. I think I might use that old wagon wheel and invent an automatic hoof polishing machine. <laughs> Mia, have you decided what you want to do for the county fair? Are you going to make something? Well, I... I'll just... <gasps> Oops. Find something to do at this hook. Hmm. Maybe Tessa will know how to fix this birdhouse. I think she won an award for making birdhouses. No! I can do it all by myself. Here I go, fixing the birdhouse. Making it the biggest, bestest, winningest, uh, award winner. Okay, well that just leaves me. Good thinking, Mr. Horse. I'll be the judge. I don't need anyone's help. I'm just as good at fixing stuff as they are. Whoa! Well, hey there, Missy. My name's Andy. Hello. My name's Mia. Welcome to my workshop, Mia. Seat. That's beautiful. Thank you, Andy. Well, look you there. You're a woodworker, too. Looks like quite a project. It used to be a birdhouse, but 
I don't know how to fix it or make a new one. Birdhouse? Hmm. Mind if I give it a try? Solve your birdhouse problem? I, uh. I know. It's still a little rough around the edges. No. I mean, it's. Wow. Just a little gift from one carpenter to another. Mmm, good pie, Tessa. La, 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 la. <laughs> Mia, that is awesome! Double awesome! I, uh, yeah, well, I guess it is. I had no idea you could do this, Mia. Uh, neither did I. Whoa, Mia! It's like a bird palace. It's still a little rough around the edges. Mia, since you're so good at making stuff, maybe you can make me a new go-kart. Oh, well, I... Ooh, you can make us all go-karts! Yeah! yeah. <sighs> and now they all want me to make them new go-karts. I just wanted to show them that I was good at something. Sounds like you didn't happen to mention that you didn't make the birdhouse. I was going to tell them, but they said it was amazing. And... I want an award so badly. Well, I think I understand. Reminds me of a little song my daddy sang to me when I still had my baby teeth. Don't compare yourself to others. Just compare yourself to you. Finding what you're good at's what you got to do. So first you stop by trying, and then when you are through, don't compare yourself to others, just compare yourself to you. Don't go fretting if someone else knows just what to do. Don't compare yourself to others, just compare yourself to you. Don't, Don't compare, compare yourself, yourself to others, just, just compare yourself, yourself to, you. to you. Putting it together is what I've got to do. Won't be spend another, and then when I am through, Don't compare myself to others. Just compare yourself to you. Don't compare yourself to others. Just compare yourself to you. Do 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 do. So you made this birdhouse? Uh huh. Sure did. And you made that birdhouse too? Uh uh. Sure didn't. Andy made that one. Who's Andy? Andy's a beaver who lives near the farm, and he makes stuff out of wood, like the fancy birdhouse. But you said that you made No, you said I made it. And I kind of liked it when you thought I did, even though I should have told the truth. But now I kind of like my birdhouse better because I made it myself. I kind of like it too. Mia, looks like the real birdhouse experts like your house the best. That's because it is the best. Really? As the official county fair judge, I hereby award Mia this first place ribbon for the best broken birdhouse fixing. Thank you, thank you all for this award. Yay, Mia! Um, you guys, I have some awards. More awards? What'd you win them for? Oh, I didn't win them. I made them for you guys. 
And the winner of the Eddie Award is... Eddie! For being the best Eddie I know. Wow! Thank you, Mia. And this one's for you, Sophie. Because you're so... So... Well, you're just the sophie -est. Aw, thanks, Mia. And this is the Kobe Award. For you, Kobe. Uh, it's just a block of wood. I left it plain because I know you'll invent it into something amazing. This is the Special Tessa Award for Best Ice Skater. But I don't know how to ice skate. Yeah, but if you did ice skate, you'd be good enough to win this award. Wow, Mia, thank you so much. And one more award. This award is for all of us, for being the best friend ever. But I think I'll keep this one. <laughs> <laughs> Smart and stuff. Mm. What are toes for? I, uh, uh, a place to keep your toenails? Why is water wet? How else are you gonna jump in puddles? I've really gotta go to the, uh... That's not why water is wet. Why is water wet? Why is anything wet? I'll tell you later, but I really, really have to go to the... But why is... Mia, I think what Kobe is trying to say is... I gotta go to the bathroom! Why didn't Kobe just say so? I think he was saying it, but like this. Oh! oh. <laughs> Come on, Eddie. You gave me an idea for a new game. I did? Cool. Um, why do dogs act like dogs? Why do cows act like cows? Why do pigs act like pigs? Maybe we should go ask a pig. How about King Pigalot? King Pigalot? Who lives in Pigalot Palace? Great idea! Let's go! Yeah! Hey, hey, we've got an adventure! And you can come along! A special kind of adventure! But first we sing this song! Pigs? Why do pigs act like pigs? Why do pigs act like pigs? Hmm. I don't know. But you are a pig. I am. Oh, yes. Yes, I suppose I am. <laughs> You're funny. Well, thank you. <laughs> but my son doesn't seem to think so. He hardly ever smiles. He seems so unhappy. Why? I don't know. Maybe you can figure it out. Would you like to meet him? Sure, why not? Yeah, that would be nice. Summoning Prince Piggington Pig. Prince. Hey! Hello! Um, wanna play or something? <sighs> uh, how about a picnic? Splendid! Why don't you join your new friends for a royal picnic? Fetch the royal picnic basket. So, keep the prince royally neat and clean, as that is the royal way. And don't forget, see if you can figure out why he never smiles. He's such a... Uh, Stick in the mud? Yes, sir. 
Uh, what's a stick in the mud? It means someone who doesn't have fun. Well, yes, of course. I knew that. I was just making sure you did. <clears throat> so, please have fun. And should things get untidy, blow this royal pig whistle and I will come to help set things royally right. <clears throat> okay, then. Enjoy the day. Would you please politely pass the royal sandwiches, please? Yes, it would be my pleasure. Uh, Prince Piggington, would you like to enjoy a sandwich? Mm. Thank you very much. He's very polite for a pig. <laughs> Should I blow the whistle and call King Pigalot? Don't bother the king. We can clean up Prince Piggington. And besides, he sounds kind of happy. Quite nice. Thank you. What next? So the way we play the game is I start a story, then we go around in a circle, and everyone adds to the story. Great! Sure. So once upon a time, there was a prince. And he had, hmm, a magic crown. And when the prince stood on his head, the magic crown would make the prince spin around really fast. Your turn, prince. And so, that is exactly what the prince did. Huh? Oh! <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> and I lived happily ever after. What's next? Hmm. Okay. Time for a royal sack race, Tessa style. We each climb into a sack and race to a finish line. <gasps> <laughs> oh, rats. The prince is making a mess. Again. I'm going to blow the whistle so the king can come and clean him up. No, Tessa, wait. Remember the king asked us to find out why the prince never smiles? Look at him now. Oh! <laughs> He's as happy as a pig in the mud. Right. Piggington might be a prince, but he's also a little kid pig. If we think like a pig, I bet we can figure out what makes him happy. If I was a pig, all I'd want to do is roll around in the mud and make a big mess. Exactly. And where is the best place for that? The farm! The farm. <laughs> yeah! Why doesn't King Pigalot let the prince act like a pig? I guess he's been a king so long, he forgot how to have pig fun. The king should really see this. Whew, that was fast. Is the prince okay? Remember you asked why he never smiles? Oh, yes, indeed. Like I always say, he's a stick in the mud. He's not a stick in the mud. He's a pig in the mud. <laughs> but, but, but... <laughs> That's no way for a prince to behave. He might be a prince, but he is a pig prince. And pigs like mud. We figured that out by thinking like him. Hmm. Thinking like someone else. Be happy growing cock a doodle doo or working in a store selling shampoo. No, a cow is happy to make milk and moo. A cow's gotta do what a cow's gotta do. Would a chicken be happy to quack like a duck or trying to drive a great big truck? No, chickens like strutting, and that is true. A chick's gotta do what a chick's gotta do. So if I think like a horse, what would I say? Hey, I'd say, hey, tastes way okay. And if I think like a pig, which I recall once having done, I'd say, here I come, son, let's have two tons of fun. Wee, 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 wee. 
<laughs> yes. So if you want to be a good friend to your friend... Or a dad to a son, here's what I recommend. Take a good look from his point of view. Cos we've, we've got, got to, to do, do what we've got, got to do. do. <laughs> Yay! Yay! You go. Now that's thinking like a pig. Eddie gave me the idea for the game when he was jumping around pretending he had to go to the bathroom. <laughs> All you have to do is pretend you're silly or happy or angry or anything you want. I'll start. Woo, yeah. Oh boy, I'm just so, wow. This is woo -hoo! You feel excited. Yes, excited. My turn. Ta-da! Happy? You feel happy? Are you happy? Yes, and I really am happy because we figured out how to make Prince Piggington happy. And we did it by thinking like him. If you want to be a good friend to your friend and make your friend Co-pilot Kobe? But we're playing farm animals. Farm's no fun compared to flying. But look at our little piggy. Isn't he a little cutie pie? <laughs> Aww. See how much fun our farm animals are? Flying is funner. We're going to the airport. Zoom, 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 zoom. Oh, no, we're not. We're going to the farm. Great idea! Let's have an adventure! Hmm. <laughs> Kobe and I say airport. Tessa and I say farm. It's two against two. So how are we going to decide? Mia! Mia! Here I am. Mia, don't you want to go to the farm? You'd rather go to the airport, right? Uh, what? As the oldest, I say we go to the farm. It's way more fun than the airport. As the awesomest, I say the airport is way more fun than the farm. So you get the deciding vote. For the airport. Farm. Airport. Farm. Well, I... Uh, they both sound, uh, why don't we think of somewhere else to go? Here's nice. But not as fun as the airport. Or the farm. How about we go on the swings? We all love the swings. See how much fun we can have right here in our own backyard? Well, I know where Kobe and I are going. Ziggy? Make that music. Two, three, four. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. We sing this song. Show 
you who's having more fun. Oh, yeah? We'll outfun you. When did fun turn into a contest? Okay, Eddie, so what's the plan? We'll fly around the farm and show Sophie how much fun we're having. It's gonna be great! Time to buckle up! Ready? to this mess in the first place? Ooh. 
I guess we did get a little, uh, messy. Yeah, we did. I'm sorry I got carried away with all that fiddling. And I'm sorry we tried to outfun you. Want to play in the backyard? Together? Together. Move! <laughs> Move! <laughs> 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 that was fun. Now it's your turn to pick out what to do. <laughs> I can do that. <laughs> that cloud looks like a butterfly. Oh, and that one looks like a bunny. And that one looks like Eddie. Hey, guys. How was your, um, fun? It wasn't. Yeah, it's no fun when you're trying to out-fun your friends. Well, we were having fun looking at the clouds. Doesn't that one look like a bunny? <laughs> nah, that's a dinosaur. Or maybe it's a great big bat. No way! That's a hippopotamus! I think it looks like a kangaroo, and it's looking for a bunny, a dinosaur, and a hippo to have fun with. <laughs> Kobe, why'd you stop? I was just getting into it. More like a loud noise. Woohoo! Yay! This is very fun! <laughs> Woohoo! I love loud noises! I'll be back. down for a nap, and they need total quiet so they can sleep. <sighs> Aren't they the cutest, sweetest, snooziest? Okay, Mia, we'll keep it down. <sighs> Every time I make some noise, someone always tells me to be quiet. I mean, wouldn't it be great if there was some place where we could make as much noise as we wanted to? Yeah. Where no one ever complains if you're loud. Yeah! Shh! Or says, shh! Hmm. The land of the loud! That's where we need to go. Where's that? It's where we can be as loud as we want. Awesome! Land of the loud, here we come! Shh! Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. You can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first, we sing this song. We sing this song. Sing this song. everyone up. Oops. Shh, don't worry. I'll sing you back to sleep when the noises are gone. Rock goodbye babies on the back lawn. You'll go to sleep 
when the noises are gone. Wait up, guys! Huh, it's kind of quiet for the land of the loud. Loud, loud, loud. Loud, 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 loud. Now that's more like it. Hey, let's really make some noise. for a while, but even I'm glad it's over. Uh-oh. It's not over yet. What do we do now? I, I wish, wish Mia was, was here to sing a lullaby. Maybe they'd quiet down. Kobe, you're a genius. I am? Well, sing a song about being quiet and get them all to join in.
We've heard you shout out loud, but now you're gonna show how quiet you can be. So take it down low. Boom, boom, boom. You can't beat them. Let's join them. She'll pick me. I have a tiara. It's time for another adventure. Hit it, Ziggy. Two, three, four. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. 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 Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And we're extra so excited. So here we go.
wait for me. Your Majesty, we came here to ask, which one of us would make the best ruler? I think I'd be good. I'd be great. I think I'd be best. I'm a leader. <laughs> My, my, you are all so excited, I can't decide who to choose. I tell you what, I'm going to visit some friends. Why don't I leave you here and let you figure out how to best rule Jungle Land while I'm gone? All right. All right. I'm glad that's settled. Well then, goodbye. See you soon! Bye. Uh, uh. I could use a little help here. Whee! I'm the best I leader. I should be the leader. No, I should be the leader. I'm brave and I'm ready to be King Eddie with courage and command. None would rule above me, the creatures would love me, the Queen of Jungle Land. This queen is surprising with her exercising, I love the feel of fitness. Well, I know how to wear a royal crown or tiara, I'm a superhero princess. It would be a biggie, kings Kobe and Ziggy and extra king on hand. I'd be double daring, I'd be extra caring, fitness I'd be sharing, a crown I'd be wearing if I rule jungle land. I should be the leader. You can't be no, king. I should be king. I should be, should king. be me. Can't be king. <laughs> Maybe it's a dinosaur. <laughs> you should be the ruler. You'd be much better than I would. You should be the ruler. I vote for you. <laughs> and we're too little. We could build something bigger. And louder. And scarier. Listen, you guys, I have an idea. Okay, here's what we do. Eddie, you guys. the monster away. Won't it? It has to, right, Sophie? We just have to stick together and be as scary and big as we can. <laughs> and laugh. Oh, I'm fine. But my froggy friends are sure frightened. That was a pretty scary puppet show. We thought a big monster got you, and we were trying to scare it away. My, my. That was quite brave of you. Of all of you. Oh, it was nothing. We're, you know, brave and stuff. We were really scared. Yeah. That too. 
But what was that sound? I was teaching the frogs my favorite jungle song. I learned it when I was just a wee little teeny tiny tortoise. One, two. Boo-ha, boo-ha, boo-ha. Isn't it a lovely song? I didn't used to like it, but now it's my favorite song ever. So, for working together, and for having the courage to face an unknown fear, I pronounce you all together, Jungle Land Rulers for a Day! Hooray! Boo-ha! 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 Welcome to Kobe Presents Jammin' with the Wigglebottom Band. Hooray! Oh, yeah! Go Ziggy! The band will now perform that favorite song, Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Ziggy digga one, Ziggy digga two. Get it going, Amp, you know what to do. Twinkle Twinkle Little Star, hip hop go, play that guitar. <laughs> this is fun. Let's dance. Yeah, <laughs> let's dance. I'm gonna dance Tessa style. That's some twinkling starry strumming. Burly, get those drums a drumming. Yeah, cool. Stars are twinkling way up high like diamonds shining in the sky. Burly, stick to the beat. Burly, my drum beaten bear. That was wild, but it wasn't fair. You can make those drum skins scream, but our band plays as a team. Two, three, four! Sounds good, guys. Go Ziggy! Now's a good time for a standing ovation. We're doing it together celebration. It's the big show with our hosts, Eddie and Sophie. Thank you, thank, thank you. you. Hi, everyone. Today we're going on a <gasps> jungle safari. It's gonna be a- My kitty, my kitty is stuck in the tree. Oh, it's a kitty emergency. Have no fear, <gasps> because Super Eddie is here! <laughs> you have to save Mr. Papa. Hang on, Mr. Papa. Super Eddie's <laughs> always ready! <laughs> Good kitty. Nice, Mr. Papa. I'm <laughs> almost there. <gasps> no! Mr. Papa, you're okay. You're okay. Wait <gasps> a second. Mr. Papa is a toy cat? Shh. He doesn't know he's a toy. I guess there's no job too big <gasps> or too small <gasps> for Super Eddie. <gasps> Sounds like Super Eddie has got a case of super hiccups. Superheroes don't get hiccups. There's only one surefire cure for hiccups. We have to scare them away. That will never work. Nothing <laughs> scares Super Eddie. Wait, I got an idea. What if we turned our jungle safari into a jungle scare-fari? A jungle scare-fari? Go! 
ahead, Sophie. But you'll never scare these hiccups away. We'll see about that. Hit it, Ziggy. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. We sing this song. Sing this song. Scare Fari's going to scare away Eddie's hiccups? I just need a little help from... <laughs> ah, monkeys! <laughs> hey, you guys, want to scare someone? <laughs> the jungle's even more <laughs> fun when you're a superhero! Let's go exploring! <laughs> Don't worry, we'll scare him next time. Well, they sure scared me. This will definitely scare him. Eddie! Want to play a game of hide and seek? Sure, you head first. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine. Ah! That was awesome. Super Eddie can fly. Let's do it again. Hey! I've got one more idea that will definitely scare him. So, Leonard. If anyone can get rid of Eddie's hiccups, you can. Super Eddie! <laughs> Woo! Woo! <laughs> Superhero, huh? <laughs> I eat superheroes for breakfast. wasn't scared at all. That's, that's impossible. Don't be upset, Leonard. You tried your best. You were super scary. Just not <laughs> to me. Woo! <laughs> Ooh! Everyone's scared of something, even if you say you're not. Everyone's scared of something. Give me whatever you've got. Will that bring out your fright? The darker the better, I always shout. Everyone's scared of something, even if you say you're not. Did I mention I'm scared of the dark? Did I mention I'm scared of a lot? Ah! 
Rats are black cats, twisty old trees, spiders or snakes or things you can't see. Everyone's scared of something. Everyone's scared of something. Everyone's scared of something. Everyone else, but not me. Scare you? What what makes you say that? Ah! Yikes, thunderstorms. I admit it. I'm scared of thunderstorms. They're so loud and big and angry and and Eddie, it's okay to be scared. Some superhero I am. When the sky roars at me, I just roar back. Take that, you thunder. Roar! Hey, thunder! Roar! Your turn, Eddie. Come on, give it a try. Okay, thunder, take this! Roar! Roar! You did it. You named it and tamed it. I named it and tamed it. Roar! <laughs> hey, everyone. Eddie's hiccups are gone. You're right. We scared them away. Roar! This is the story of Little Miss Muffet who sat on a tuffet. I didn't know what a tuffet was. Is a mushroom okay? <sighs> Little Miss Muffet sat on a mushroom, eating her curds and whey. What are curds and whey? <sighs> Little Miss Muffet sat on a mushroom, eating her apple. Then along came a spider and sat down beside her. <gasps> and Super Eddie came to the rescue! You're not in this fairy tale. Hey, nothing says fairy tale like a superhero. Now, Miss Muffet, are you scared of spiders? Uh-huh, spiders. <laughs> Well, Miss Muffet, you've named your fear. Now you have to tame your fear. She's supposed to be frightened. Okay, down, Spider. Sit, Spider. <laughs> nice, <laughs> Spider. Run away, run away. But I'm not scared anymore. <sighs> oh, well. So little Miss Muffet sat on her mushroom, eating her apple with her pet spider that she wasn't scared of at all. The end. Yay, Yay Miss Muffet! Muffet. <laughs> <laughs> Lucky, you're gonna love Littleville. It's the best place to live. <sighs> or take a nap. Good day, Sophie. Good day to you, Mia. Taking Mr. Papa for a stroll, I see. Yes, and he's been very well behaved. Hello, ladies of Littleville. What are you doing on this fine day, Eddie? I was just about to make a mud pie. Did someone say pie? Mmm, I love pie. See, Lucky, Littleville is the nicest, friendliest little town in the entire world. Beep, beep. I'm just coming home after a hard day at work. Hessa, follow the directions. The road goes around Littleville, not through it. No problem. 
problem. I'm driving Tessa style. Vroom. <laughs> Look out! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> vroom. 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 Uh oh. So cool! Oops. Oh, rats. You broke Littleville. I'm sorry. I'll fix it. We'll all help. But first, let's play obstacle course. We can run around here, and then we can jump over this. That looks like fun. Let's find a real obstacle course. Where are we going to do that? What about the jungle? It has lots of stuff to jump over and crawl through. Yes, a jungle obstacle course. We'll have a race. And I'll win. Let's go! We'll fix Littleville later. And you can come along A special kind of adventure But first we sing this song We sing this song Sing this song Sing this song Sing this song We sing this song Hey, hey, we've got an adventure Guys, welcome to the official jungle obstacle course. You've all chosen your teammates. Hmm. Yay! We've got our team. All right. <laughs> oh, teammate! Great idea. Got any dinosaurs? Let me check. No. All right. Oh, yeah. Oh, boy. Okay. I'm Emmett, and I'm winning today. Whoa. Hey, Emmett. I'm Eddie, and I'm ready to win. Want to be my teammate? Deal. Yes! Ahem. <clears throat> Attention, racers. Oh, yeah. All eyes here. Listen carefully. Everyone has to follow the arrows. Give me five. All right. Follow the arrows. We're so gonna win this. Oh, yeah. Follow the... Hey, Eddie. Arrows. That's not fair. We got a head start. Let the official jungle obstacle course race begin. Yeah! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Yeah! Woohoo! <laughs> 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 All right, okay. Which way? Which way? That way. No, I say this way. Here we go. Gonna win this. Yeah! <laughs> 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 <gasps> Emmett, look out! Whoa! <laughs> Yuck! <laughs> Come on, guys, this way. This is fun. They're getting ahead of us. Follow me this time. Let's go that way. Mm. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Come on, Emmett. Go, go, go. Oh. 
Whoa! Oh, no! Oh. Huh? Everybody, go this way! I don't get it. We're faster and stronger. What are we doing wrong? Okay, this time, follow me. No, follow me. I said follow me. <sighs> this is fun. <laughs> Come on, guys, this way. Here's a red arrow. They're going to win. We need a shortcut. That way, through the log. <laughs> Eddie, I'm stuck. <laughs> Get me out of here. Hold on! Whoa! Do that again! And put more elephant into it! Win. No, no, no. That's the finish line over there. And this is the starting line. You mean we're right back where we started? Precisely. Maybe next time you'll follow the arrows. Hmm? Huh? Come on, Emmett. Let's start over and try again. And this time, follow the arrows. Yeah, if we'd followed the arrows the first time, we would have won for sure. True, true, so very true. And for that reason, I present you both an award for Most Improved Team. Congratulations! Hooray! Congratulations! Give me five. <laughs> Way to go, guys! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, everyone, just follow my directions. Eddie, you put your box over there. Mia, that box goes on top of Kobe's. Tessa, now put your box on top. Just a little that way. That's perfect. Our little bill house looks even better than before. Hey. I bet it'll look even better if we knock it down one more time and build it all over again. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> okay. Who turned out the light? <laughs> and now, live from our very own backyard stage, it's magnificent Mia and her sensational circus! Hooray! Hooray! Oh boy, can't wait! For our first amazing act, the amazing Benini will fly through the air while doing a triple tumble. <laughs> All right, right for Mia! Good job, Mia. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Next. The 
greatest juggling act ever, Zebra and the Bear. This is juggling Tessa style. <laughs> wow, Tessa's really good. Amazing is more like it. Tessa, I'm doing my circus. Just trying to help out. I love the circus. I'm a really good juggler. I can see. Hooray! Oh, Tessa! Wow, good very job. impressive. The circus is so much fun. You've been to the circus? Lots of times. I know all the moves. I want to go to the circus. I want to be in the circus. Me too. How about we go to the circus and put on a circus show? Definitely. Yeah. Okay. Hey, Mia, can I wear the ringmaster hat? Well, I guess so. Hit it, Ziggy. And you can come along A special kind of adventure But first we sing this song We sing this song Sing this song Sorry, folks. Circus closed a long time ago. I'm just here keeping an eye on things. That's okay. We didn't come here to see the circus. We want to be in the circus. Oh, putting on a show, are you? Hey, that's great. Tell you what, you go right on in and leave the rest to me. <laughs> to put on the best circus ever! Tessa style! Mia, you're on the unicycle! It's easy to ride, only half as hard as a bike. You can do this! Eddie, this is for you! <laughs> Now, now just dance, dance on, on top, top of it while it rolls around. around. Whoa. <laughs> Get on the ball, Eddie. You can do this. Kobe? Ugh. Did I do that right? They're juggling moves for juggling. It's lunchtime? You're going to be our star plate spinner. Balance plate on pole, spin plate. Easy. You can do this. Okay, circus performers, let's practice. Practice, practice. That's right, you heard me. There's going to be a circus and Everyone's invited. Ha, ha, ha. 
this way to the circus, folks. Just follow me. <laughs> Guys? Guys? Yeah. Guys? <laughs> Don't you want to put on the best show ever? We were just having fun. This is circus time, not clown around time. Well, that's it, folks. Step right in. Plenty of room for everyone. Great. Here comes the audience. I guess I'm going to have to do this all by myself. Tessa, Wait a minute. we can help, help you. No, forget it. <sighs> You can do this. <sighs> Ladies and gentlemen, animals of all ages, welcome to Tessa's One Ring Circus. <laughs> We've got a great show for you. I mean, I've got a great show for you. I mean, I, uh... I guess it's just going to be me today. Oh, too bad. Too bad. It's just me all alone in the spot. And I'm really not feeling so hot. Just me. charge for now. I think today we should have Mia's dance party. But I don't know what to do. Maybe your animal friends can help. Thanks, Tessa. You don't need a lot of hair to dance like a teddy bear. Just give the arms a tug and hug, hug, hug. Bang you move your feet to the dance. Trying to fix the 
music. Don't fix it. Make it louder. <laughs> We outran the octopus. Gotcha. No one outruns the octopus. Now swim along, little fishies. One, two. When do three, I get to be the four. octopus? In a minute. One, two. I bet it would be more fun three, if we all played against an four, octopus. Five, hey, why don't we play six, octopus tag with the real seven, octopus? Eight, yeah, that would be awesome. Ten. Hmm. Fixed it. Just in time. We're going on an adventure to find a real octopus to play tag with. Hit it, Ziggy. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. 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 song. Hey, hey, we bought an adventure. And we're extra so excited. So here we go. Adventure ho. And everyone is <laughs> <sighs> I've got to fix this thing again. You guys go without me. You sure, Kobe? Yeah, I'm sure. Okay, well, and everyone's invited! <laughs> Ahoy! Any sign of a friendly octopus? Whoa! There he is! On a big blinking sign! He's pointing that way! Oh, oh, can I see? In a minute! Is it a minute yet? Another sign! Ooh! Now the octopus is playing with the ball! Tessa! It's been like a million minutes. When can I see? In a minute. Sophie, Tess is totally hogging the telescope. The octopus looks super fun. Can we see? In a minute. Oh, rats. I'll never get a turn. It's another octopus sign. A really big one. And he's waving. And he's pointing. At an island, and it's got the coolest looking playground ever. Can, Can we, we see? In a minute. Double rats. <laughs> oh, wow. A jungle gym. Cool. Oh, boy, a seesaw. Hooray, beach ball. Are some mateys. Visitors. Excellent! Hello! Wow! Hi! Hi! Hello. Welcome to OctoFun Island! <gasps> Shall we have OctoFun? Yes! Let's! How about Octopus Tag? I'll be... Great! Yes! Octopus Tag! I'll be the octopus! One, two, three, go! <laughs> ah! Yeah. I win! I win! <laughs> Can I be the octopus now? In a minute! First, one, two, three, go! <gasps> I win again! I win again! I think it's time for a new game. <laughs> yeah. hey. hey! I win! But we're not playing tag anymore. Oops, right, so sorry. When's our turn? In a minute. Do, 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 do. Yeah. In a minute. Where have I heard that before? Here it comes. <laughs> I got it. It's mine. <laughs> 
<laughs> Excuse me. Sorry. Pardon. Hey, can we finish our game? In a minute. Always in a minute. In a minute. In a... Oh. That does sound kind of familiar. Uh-huh. Like me, playing octopus tag. Uh-huh. And when I wouldn't share the telescope. Uh-huh. I'm sorry, guys. And I'm going to make it up to you. You invite new friends to visit And tell them, hey, let's play So you show them all your really cool stuff But then take it away and say In a minute, you can play with my stuff In a minute But that minute's never through And it's only fun for you What's the word? Shellfish? No! Selfish! Yes, right. Selfish! Terribly sorry. I should work on that. In a minute. <laughs> we oh. Yeah. Oh. We tried to help him, Tessa. Well, maybe one day he'll learn to share. Just like I did. Hey, who wants the telescope? I do. I want the telescope. I want to go next. Toby? So, did you get the band working? No, not yet. Greetings, excellent Earthlings. Hello, strange alien person creature with two heads. We were drawn to your planet by your beautiful music. You like this weird music? It is our favorite song from home. We like to sing it. Together, shall we? Bleep, bloop, bleepa, bloop, bleep, bleep, bloop, bleepa, bloopa, bloop, bleep, 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 bleep. Thank you, thank you very much. <sighs> Did you not enjoy our performance? Magical maker of beautiful music. Sorry. Yeah, it was great. It's just. I've been trying to fix this, but I need one more piece of wire. Since you have shared your music with us, we will share it part of us with you. Please take wire connecting our brains. Gosh, thanks. Thank you. 
Oops, didn't see you there. You didn't hear me either. These were supposed to be mattresses for my fairy tale, the princess in the pea. How can I be a princess who falls asleep on a pile of mattresses if the mattresses aren't piled up? I'm really sorry, Mia. I wasn't listening. Look, we can put them back again. Oh, rats. Where's the pea? I can't do the princess in the pea without a pea. The pea under the mattress is supposed to keep me awake. Wait, maybe I have one. Let me check my pockets. Cracker, dog toy, seashell. Hmm, that's strange. I'm all out of peas. Thanks anyway, Sophie. I'll keep looking. We're going to search for treasure. Want to come? You guys go without me. Are you sure, Mia? Sure, I'm sure. I'm not going anywhere until I find that pea. Okay, bye, Mia. Hmm. Two, three, four! Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. We sing this song. Sing this song. has just begun. Yo-ho-ho, ho, and a barrel of fun. Captain, something strange up ahead. Something sparkly. Sparkly? Could be treasure. It looks like a sea of bottles. Sea, sea of bottles! bottles. Ah, sea, sea of bottles. bottles! Hey, parrots. Must be the sea of bottles. <laughs> Let's see if there's a message in one of these bottles. Hmm. Hmm. Nope. <gasps> Could this be? Marks the spot, and that means treasure. What's this squiggly thing? Maybe it's a warning? A warning of what? A squirrely seashell? Some squiggly seaweed? Well, maybe we should sail around it just in case. But that'll just waste time. There's treasure waiting. Set sail, mateys. Aye, aye, aye Captain. Captain. Treasure, treasure, hooray! I wonder if that swirl might be a... When I open my treasure chest, I will find Marbles of a colorful kind Some are big, some are tiny Spotted and striped, round and shiny We should sail around this swirly thing Sail, sail around, around swirly thing! thing. Ah, sail, sail around swirly thing. thing! At least you're listening to me ah, ah. Hey, Sophie! Can you look through your telescope to see if... When I open my treasure chest, I will find Beautiful shells of every kind Clams and oysters, maybe a pearl I'm worried about this squiggly swirl! When I open my treasure chest, I will oh. find oh. Dancing shoes of every kind Jazz and swing shoes, flamenco too Tango shoes for the dances I do Shoes or maybe tap. I really don't like what I saw on that map. Ah. If 
we're heading into trouble. We've got to do something. Ah, come with me! Ah, ah. That's the treasure I love the best. When I open my treasure chest, a vast ahoy anchors away. We treasure our treasure, treasure hooray! Guys, I could use a little help. Treasure? Okay! Treasure today! Kobe was trying to tell us. The swirl on the map is a... Whoa, Boo! We should have listened to you. What do we do now, Kobe? Uh, Eddie, Sophie, take the wheel. Tessa, pull that rigging. Ah, uh, yeah, I can't, Kobe. Kobe. be the best treasure of all! Still gotta find the pea. Gotta find the pea. Pretend it's a pea. It's perfect. Mm. Mm. <gasps> Mia? Mm. Ta da! <laughs> and the princess and the pea lived happily ever after. <laughs> <laughs> And I changed my mind. But... 
What was that? Beats me. Anyway, I really want to go on an adventure to the restaurant. But we both decided... to go to the pirate ship. And then I decided to do something different. What is that? Oh, it's me. Why are you being so grumbly? It's not me being grumbly. It's my tummy. The dog stole my breakfast, and I'm starving. Hold on. I think I might have a... Here, half a grilled cheese sandwich. Still warm. My favorite. Thanks. Well, we should definitely go to the restaurant now. You're hungry, right, Mia? I could eat. Okay, have it your way, Mr. Bossy Banana Pants. Great! Hit it, Kobe. I mean, Ziggy. Hey, hey, we've got an adventure. And you can come along. A special kind of adventure. But first we sing this song. We sing this song. Finally, it's way past our lunchtime, and we're all very hungry. The dog must have eaten their breakfast, too. Thank you very much. Um, you're welcome. We beg your royal pardon, King Pigalot. We didn't know you were waiting for us. So, what's on the menu? We were hoping you'd tell us. Well, that's great! We can make whatever we want! Come on, guys! Be right back! Splendid! Thank you. So, guys, what can we make the pigs for their lunch? I know! Pizza! Everyone loves pizza! Especially you, Eddie. But I love pizza, too! Me, too! Me, three! Okay. Me as well, I guess. It was my idea, so I should be the boss. How about everyone's the boss of something? Okay, but I'll be the boss of everyone who's being a boss. Mia, you can be the boss of greeting customers. Tessa, you be the boss of taking orders. Kobe, you be the boss of scrubbing the dishes. Um, gee, thanks. You're welcome. And what about me? Sophie, you can be, um, the boss of being my assistant chef. Your assistant? What does an assistant chef do? Well, whatever I tell you, I guess. <laughs> I mean, I am the boss. Hmm, I don't know about this. We want food! We want food! We want food! We want food! Okay, team, let's get to work. So what's first, boss? We're going to need flour for the pizza dough, and lots of it. How much dough do we need to make? All of it, for one giant pizza. Really, are you sure? Sophie, of course I'm sure. I'm the boss, remember? Okay, if you say so. <laughs> Just wait till you have to wash all the dishes. <sighs> Hi, how are you today? I'll be your server. We're hungry. 
Hey, what's to eat? What would you like to eat? May I take your order? Hey, where's the grub? Welcome! <laughs> where's my food? Oh, I'm super hungry! Wow, that's one giant dough ball. It sure is. Good luck, boss. The good news is that they all love pizza. The bad news is they all want it now. Can't you stall them? Mia's trying. She's telling a fairy tale. But I'm not sure that Three Little Pigs is the best idea. And so the big bad wolf said, I'll huff and I'll puff and I'll blow your house down. It's horrible. Okay, well, I just need to throw it in the air and catch it. You know, like chefs do. But that dough is huge. Shouldn't we do it together? The boss wants to do it himself. That's right. I'm in charge. I don't need any help. But... <sighs> oh, no! The Jobo! We have to get it back! But you said you could do it yourself, Eddie. Yeah, boss. You get it back. I'll never be able to catch that giant dough ball all by myself. I need your help. Okay, but on one condition. Right. We work together. Yeah, no bosses. Okay, you got it. Now let's get that dough ball. And then the big, scary wolf right to the roof of the little pig's house. <laughs> um, keep the stories coming, Mia. We'll be right back. Hurry, catch the dough ball! Quick, it's getting away! <laughs> we have to get it back! Oh no! Ew, yuck! That's one disgusting dough ball. It's ruined! What are we going to do now? You know, the pigs might actually like a money pizza. Hey, Sophie's right. It's covered with all their favorite gross things. But how will we get it back to the restaurant? Wait, I have an idea. Kobe, can you drive a tractor? Yeah. <laughs> I guess pigs aren't the only ones who like mud. Need a hand? And this little piggy went wee, wee, wee all the way home. Ooh! <laughs> wee! One giant and quite delicious mud-covered pizza with extra grass and straw. And other gross stuff. Oh, thank goodness. I was running out of pig stories. You made this, Chef Eddie? We made it together, your pigginess. All of us. Even me. Sort of. Well, I must say, that is a pizza fit for a pig. A pig king, that is. And what, may I ask, is for dessert, Chef Eddie? Hmm, better ask the team. I'm not the boss anymore. <laughs> my tummy saying, I'm still hungry. <laughs> my tummy just said the same thing. Mine agrees. That makes four of us. Since we couldn't eat the pizza, I thought you guys would like some cookies. Cookies! cookies! Yeah! Yay! Yay! Thank you, Eddie. 
Hey, don't look at me. It's Lucky. Here, Lucky. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha,